The whole idea of ignoring in the twisted world of relationship psychology is a relatively new phenomenon. Back in the day, like 50 years ago, folks didn't waste their time with terms like tug-of-war, ghosting, and manipulation. Nah, they were too busy actually making things work instead of playing these mind games. Back then, breakups were like finding a four-leaf clover rare as hell. The divorce rate? You could probably count the cases on one hand. But fast forward to today, and it's like everyone's treating relationships like they're disposable. Nobody sticks around long enough to actually appreciate what they've got. Nowadays, if you want to be loved, you better come with a damn good reason and a list of benefits as long as your arm. It's like people forgot how to just be with each other without expecting something in return. In this day and age, both guys and gals love to play the ignore game to tip the scales in their favor. But let's cut the BS ignoring someone just screams, I don't give a damn about you. Can you really claim to love someone while acting like they don't exist? Hell no. Because at the end of the day, it's all about numero uno. Women, especially, are pros at this ignoring game, especially when they're trying to rope a dude into their web. They flick on the switch of unavailability and watch as guys come crawling, begging for their attention. And you know what's messed up? They'll pull this stunt even on the dudes they're into. You could tick all the boxes for what a woman wants, act normal as can be, and still get hit with the cold shoulder. Why? Because women love to play the unattainable card just like every other chick out there. Take this one girl I was talking to recently, treated me like I was some bottom feeder for no damn reason. And when I called her out on it, she acted all innocent like we barely even knew each other. My guess? She pulls this crap on everyone. So naturally, I ghosted her faster than you can say see ya. And you know what's even more messed up? She starts hitting me up later like nothing happened, but by then, I was already on to the next. Too many women out there are playing a losing game when it comes to relationships. And as for ignoring dudes, they pull that stunt too, whether they're in a relationship or after a breakup, hoping to reel their ex back in. Newsflash, it's a recipe for disaster. Here's the deal. Men shouldn't bother with ignoring, or if they do, they damn sure shouldn't do it the way women do. Because let's face it, when guys try to pull the ignoring card, it's usually about as convincing as a toupee in a hurricane. They're just not themselves in those moments. To really ignore a woman properly, you gotta stop playing games and just be that guy. That's the only way it's gonna work 100%. In other words, you gotta give zero SH asterisk T's about her, and that's when it'll actually work. Bet you've had a chick in your life who was all about you, but you couldn't care less. You showed that indifference for a while, but then decided to give it a shot anyway. And as things progressed, she started to mean something to you. But then, out of nowhere, you noticed she was pulling away. Suddenly she meant the world to you, and she was the whole damn package. See how relationships can flip a man's perspective on a dime? When you act like you couldn't care less, she starts caring. But the minute you actually don't care, she starts to slip away. So here's the bottom line. If a woman holds any significance to you, she won't give you much credit. But if you couldn't care less about her, for some reason, she starts seeing value in you. But why does it always play out this way? We couldn't care less about the women who couldn't care less about us. It's because women are drawn to men's unavailability. They crave those emotional roller coasters, and they get them in spades when they realize they're knocking on a door that won't budge. They see a guy like that as something special, because let's face it, a real catch ain't going to be easy. He's not going to be opening doors left and right. He'll be out of reach. She might be surrounded by a dozen decent dudes, even some real lookers, but she won't give them the time of day because they're the ones chasing her. And then, out of nowhere, some regular Joe starts ignoring her, and she's drifting towards him, even though he's just average or even worse off than the ones chasing after her. When I first started diving into psychology, I figured it was just coincidence that women value the ones who don't value them. But the more I learned about women, the more I realized it's the damn truth. Only a tiny fraction of women, maybe a couple of percent, actually appreciate a man who truly cherishes them with all his heart. The rest, the other 90%, they need the guys who don't give a damn. But when it comes to a guy who ignores, well, he's just not putting the relationship first. If you try to ignore a woman, but she still means the world to you, she'll see right through it. She'll know you value her, but are just putting on an act. 
And let me tell you, that ain't gonna fly because you're just fooling yourself. When your life is consumed by your own pursuits, leaving little room for romantic entanglements, you'll notice something intriguing. Women, or rather, romantic relationships, start to fade into the background. When some gal shoots you a text, but you're knee-deep in meaningful endeavors, she'll complain that you're not giving her the time of day. But once you no longer crave relationships like you used to, you'll see how all the women around you suddenly start to hold you in higher regard. This, my friend, is the kind of ignoring that works like a charm. The most worthwhile investment of your time is in yourself. Too many men believe that to attract more women, they need to put on a show to impress them. But the truth is, to draw women into your orbit, all you've got to do is be a man and not sweat the small stuff. Just keep forging ahead on your journey of self-improvement and focus on your own happiness. Without even trying, you'll observe how women begin to appreciate you more. It's funny how life works. The finest women tend to waltz into our lives when we least expect it. So don't waste your precious time hunting for relationships or trying to win over any one particular woman. The 99% of guys who chase after women are a sorry bunch, achieving little to nothing. They're just spinning their wheels, going nowhere fast. It's all pretty straightforward, really. You don't need to bend over backward for women, live for yourself, and even in your interactions with them, show love not towards them, but towards yourself, and watch how the demand for your presence skyrockets. Ignoring only works when you genuinely find women intrusive, are prepared to ditch them, and don't hold them in any regard whatsoever. Some guys are a hit with women because they're too wrapped up in their own lives to care much about relationships. But if they wanted to, they could have a new girl every Saturday. A man's power in relationships doesn't lie in his ability to attract, charm, or concoct schemes for a woman. It's all about maintaining self-respect and dignity. Modern women obliterate a man's dignity. Their every instinct, manipulation, and effort to control you chip away at your self-esteem, turning you into a doormat, a failure. A man's strength lies in knowing how to remain unaffected by a woman, refusing to play by her rules, and resisting her attempts to tie you down. If you think that ignoring means dodging someone, but they mean a lot to you, then it's a surefire recipe for failure. You should be indifferent to whether you have relationships with women or not, and disregard their attempts to walk away. It's crucial to remove those rose-tinted glasses and recognize that if you're with an attractive woman, you won't necessarily be able to hold on to her. She'll either leave of her own volition or she won't. But I can guarantee you 120%, the most potent way to keep a woman is to value yourself more than her and not tiptoe around her. Don't fear losing her and she won't leave.